James Yoder back for the Michigan Football Report, a new segment, 2018 Michigan Football, true or false, 10 questions today. One of you guys going to tell you what I think of them. Question number one, will Shea Patterson break Michigan's single season touchdown record for passing touchdowns held by two men, it's held by uh, Chad Henney with 25 and also Elvis Gerback with 25. 2004, Henney made that as a freshman. Gerback back in 1991 when Desmond Howard won the Heisman, caught 19 of those. Navarre, Henney, Henney, you see a, a big time uh, a part of, of, of this list. Will Shea Patterson break Michigan's football touchdown passing record in a season in 2018, ladies and gentlemen? I am actually saying true. This will happen. I want to know from you guys. So in the comments below, Facebook Live, YouTube Live, type one for true, two for fa false. Will Shea Patterson throw for more than 25 touchdowns to break the Michigan football single season record? All right, question number true. True or false? Will Michigan have two wide receivers over 1,000 yards receiving in 2018? I saw somebody put this on the internet. They thought that they had Michigan have two guys, Black, Peoples, Jones. It is almost, no, it has never happened, but it's almost never been even close that Michigan has had two guys. So the closest you ever had is back in 07, Manningham and Arrington, you know, maybe the best combo, at least with a senior quarterback in Chad Henney. Braylon Edwards and Jason Devon almost did it. Even, you know, guys like Gal and Funches, no one's even come close. So for you to think that Michigan, with this kind of receiving production, one guy over, three, or two guys over 300 yards uh, in 2017, Black come back from injury. If you think it could happen, you're crazy. I say false in this one, but I'm going to leave it up to you guys. Press 1 if you think this one is true. Type it in the comments. YouTube Live, Facebook Live. Type 2 for true. If you think Michigan gives two 1,000 yard wide receiver receivers, it could include a, uh, a tight end on this one. All right, question number three in Michigan football, true or false, will Rashawn Gary be a first team All-American in 2018? This is a pretty interesting one because I think on the surface people want to say, yes, absolutely he will be. He's one of the best players in America, a top five draft pick. Michigan had Mo Hurst in the D-line, Jordan Lewis, Jake Butt prior to that in the Harbaugh era, but I am actually going to say false on this one it has nothing to do with Rashawn Gary being a bad player. One, Michigan's line is completely stacked uh, this year, so he's not going to make it get as many stats as he should, but that could help him a little bit. Two, is that Rashawn Gary has not produced the stats that you know demand All-American potential. And three, this is the most stacked defensive line uh, class going into you know, the, the whole country this year that I can ever remember in college football. Uh, Clemson alone is four guys in the D-line. They're going to be first-round draft picks. Ohio State, all these guys, Alabama. So he's going to have a ton of competition. There's these 15 guys that could. I am saying false. I know from you guys, one for true, two for false in the comments section below. Next up, Michigan will have three first round draft picks in the 2019 NFL draft, true or false? Pretty interesting because they could have a lot of guys go pro. Shea Patterson, uh, Rashawn Gary, Lavert Hill, Kaleek Hudson, Devin Bush Jr. All these guys could go pro early. Uh, Chase Winovich could go pro early as well. So keep an eye out for Michigan's having an exodus after this season. People want to say yes, I want to say yes, but I am giving you yes. True on this one, want to know from you guys. Press one if you think it's true, press two if you say it is false that Michigan will have three first round draft picks in the 2019 NFL Draft. It's only happened twice in school history, so it would be a big deal. Could they have four? You never know, it could happen. All right, next up on the list, will Michigan have, uh, will Michigan have a top 10 offense in yards per game and defense yards per game in 2018? Obviously on defense, people definitely expect it, but it would take a huge, huge leap for them to get there on offense. We look coming up on the offensive staff under Jim Harbaugh, 105th in yards per game last year, 58th in 2016, 69th and 15th. So I think it would take a huge leap. I am saying absolutely false on this one. There's no way the offense is in the top 10 yards. Michigan does not play that kind of up-tempo football to get there. Want to know from you guys, type one for true. If you think both offense and defense will be in there, type two for false. Next up on the list, we have a question for you true or false will Michigan go undefeated in their three big road games against rivals Notre Dame Michigan State both on the road by the way if you watch the previous segment of the show and Ohio State come on this has got to be crazy you got to be out of your mind if you think Michigan's going defeated right losses last year to both Michigan and Ohio State 2016 beat Ohio State or beat Michigan State uh, lost to Ohio State, uh, both those games, of course, uh, on the road. And then 2015, same deal that we do have that drop punt. I am saying false. I'm going to put a 2-1 record. I'll give those picks later on in the month of August. I want to know from you guys, though, one for true, two for false. Will Michigan go undefeated in those three big road games in 2018? Notre Dame, Michigan State, Ohio State. Next question, true or false? 
Will Michigan break the single season average attendance record uh, for most of you know, people coming to games divided by seven home games? You know the deal there. I'm going to, you know, consider this one. If we look at the stats for when Michigan's broke this record, 2012, 11, 10, 13, 17, definitely some precedent for Michigan have a lot of attendance the, in, in recent years. No Ohio State, no Michigan State, no Notre Dame at home this year. So I am going to say false on this one. It is not going to happen. You're going to see a few of these games, maybe Southern Methodist, maybe some other ones, that Michigan won't have the attendance uh, that they'll need to break that record. So I'm going to say false on this one. Want to know from you guys. Type one for true, two for false. Will Michigan break that single season attendance record uh, in 2018 for most you know, average attendance per game yeah, throughout the entire home season? Next one, true or false, will Jim Harbaugh have a top five recruiting class in 2019? Currently sitting at five with 19 recruits. Might be losing a recruit, as you saw in our previous segment of the show, in Stephen Heron in the matter of days. 21st last year, fifth and eighth. So one of the last four years, that 37 in 2015 doesn't really count. But I want to know from you guys, I am saying false. They don't have a lot of wiggle room left. They're number five right now. I'm going to go ahead and say this one is false. But I want to hear from you guys, of course. One for true. Two for false if you think Michigan will have a top five recruiting class in 2019. The guys are currently going into the senior year of high school. All right, rapid fire, baby. Number nine, will Michigan have a player break the single season sack record of 12 in 2018? David Bowen had 12 back in 1996. Now, you've got guys like Sean Gary, you've got Aubrey Solomon, you've got Chase Winovich. You could have a big time player break the record. I am going to say true. I think it's going to be Chase Winovich going to break the record. True, he'll have 13 or 14 sacks. Rashawn Gary will take some of the, uh, the uh, attention off him. Want to know from you guys, though. Keep hitting the comments. We're going to be talking about this all day long. I'm going to jump in the comments section. Last one, number 10. Will Michigan make the college football playoff in 2018? James Yoder is saying true. Want to know from you guys. Will Michigan make the college football playoff in 2018? Press 1 for true. Press Press two for false. I am predicting Michigan to have an 11 and one regular season record, win the Big Ten, make it to the college football playoff, and that has been your 2018 Michigan football true or false. I am James Yoder. Follow me on Twitter, and we will see you next time.